I have opened here the information for the next events. Uh, unlock new rewards together during the bounties of Blackwood events. Uh, the bounties of Blackwood event kicks off Thursday, September 30th at 10 a.m. Eastern and runs until Tuesday, the 12th, 10 a.m. During the event period, you and your fellow ESO players can work together to unlock incredible new rewards by earning the Blackwood Pathfinder achievements. To do so, simply visit the six unique striking locales in the zone and every day will update the meter found in the Bounties Blackwood page. With the community's ongoing progress, once the meter reaches 100% or the event ends, we'll add the unlocked rewards to the Crown Crate store in a single bundle for all Blackwood owners to claim. These rewards can include the Pellucid Jelly Swamp Pet, unlocked at 33%. The Shadows of Blackwood Markings, unlocked at 66%. And a Cascading Bounty Box, whatever. What is that? Unlocked at 100% with a chance to include such items as the undaunted plunder, rare materials, or item sets, and guaranteed to include a tunable crafting stations and a unique Ogrim target dummy. A dummy. This would be cool if it was a um, par proper parse dummy, you know, a useful like parse dummy and not like a um, furnishing item parse dummy. We need more in Blackwood. What do you mean? This event is going to rock? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Any reason to go back to Blackwood is a good one. An incredible mystery prize will reveal during the Gates of Oblivion year end stream also unlocks at 100%. An incredible mystery prize? What could it be? All we know is that it's incredible. What the heck is it? What do you guys think it is? What do you guys think the incredible mystery prize is? You already have Pathfinder? I dude, I do too. I've contributed. I've contributed to the cause. I've got Pathfinder. A house? We're already getting a house in the fourth quarter. No way they're giving us another one for this event. So it's a community goal event. Nice. We haven't had one for a while. Yeah, the last community goal event I can remember was uh, Skyrim last year. Where we got a house. Yeah, we got a house for that, didn't we? Five soul gems. Sounds bright. Isn't the last piece of the Griffin for sale? Yeah, the last piece of the Griffin. We'll get there. You're rushing ahead. Hold on. Hold your horses, serotonin. Hold your horses. In addition to the community challenge, you can also earn bonus rewards during this event while adventuring in the Blackwood Zone. To get started, pick up the bounties of Blackwood introductory quests in the in-game crown store or the impresario tent. Blackwood Legates Coffers. During the event period, you're the first time you complete a daily quest in Blackwood or the Rock Grove Trial weekly quest instead, you receive a glorious Blackwood Legates Coffer. This new reward box has a chance to contain some of the following items. Crafting materials. Valuables. You can trade to merchants for gold. Treasures. Um, style items for Blackwood motifs. Blackwood gear. Treasure maps or surveys. Blackwood motif chapters. A fragment of the new Voroplasm pets. Combine seven of these to create the pets. Blackwood themed furnishings and furnishing recipes. If you have Bastion or Miri active, a piece of companion gear. So make sure that you have Miri and Bastion out when turning in your quests and opening more, and most importantly, when opening these coffers, because if they're out, you might get companion gear. Eh? If you continue to complete daily quests after the first, you can earn regular Blackwood Legates. Uh, Legates Coffers, which have a lower chance to contain the rare rewards. You can also find re regular Blackwood Legate Coffers in the following ways. As a drop from Delvin World Bosses earned when completing portals. As a drop from Blackwood Monsters found in treasure chests, safe boxes, thieves troves, Sigic portals, and other containers. Basically any node. And found when, oh yeah, here it is. Harvesting crafting resource nodes. There it is. In addition to the above, all Blackwood daily quests and the weekly Rock of Trial quests have their regular rewards doubled. So, if you have not yet farmed your Bosses Mania, your soon to be completely irrelevant Sulzon, Stone Talkers, right? There's some really good sets in um, Rock Grove. Now it's time to go grab. Them. Well, it is kind of at least to get it started. At least to get it started. Yeah. Sex. Yeah. Sex heals. 
yeah some good sets there and you can get them twice as fast right now so get your collection started during this event and then finish it once the new rng comes out right so you'll get most of it done and then new rng system comes out boom you finish it off easy um impresario events and tickets <laughs> During the Bounties of Blackwood event, you can earn up to two tickets per day. For the first time, you complete a Blackwood daily, meaning you can earn up to 26 tickets. Oh, good. They saved me the work of doing the math. Always have to do that, and I always get it wrong. Uh, over the entire event, don't forget the event ticket timer resets at 2 a.m. each morning. And that if you earn new event tickets over the 12 cap limit, you will lose them. Here's what the Impresario event merchant will have in stock during the event. Unstable Morpholith Bone Base Fragments. Talking is hard today. Including the Deadlands Flint, Rune Etched Striker, and Smoldering Bloodgrass Tinder. All three fragments for Dag 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 Dagonic Quasi Griff to upgrade your Unstable Morpholith with. The Smoke Wreath Griffin Feather Black Iron Bit Burtle and the new Black Iron Serps. Okay, so the pieces of your Marin. Basically, you could finish your... your uh, your griffin yeah a voraplasm pet fragment is this a new type of voraplasm one or is it the one we got from like Merkmare? maybe they'll have a picture here assorted blackwood themed furnishings group repair kits where the hell are all the pictures where's the pictures of these of the style pages the pictures of the voraplasm the pictures of all the stuff we're supposed to be hyped about well there's rewards we don't know what they look like but 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 they're cool uh probably most important to a lot of people is going to be this mount that you can finish off this this is the quasi griffin if you haven't seen it yet it looks cool i mean when they said it's going to be a griffin when they said it's going to be a griffin without feathers i was like I, or without wings i had my doubts guys i had my doubts i was like a, a griffin without wings guys but then it actually looks cool i was like oh, okay all right you won me over this looks pretty badass actually I like it. So I'll be getting mine during this event. Are we getting another event before the Witches Festival? If not to my knowledge, it should be Blackwood and then Witches. Unless um, they have like some bonus announcement. Maybe this is the look. This is the jelly pla The This is the jellyfish that they talked about. Maybe this is the gear. I don't know what this is. Maybe this is one of the looks. 